This is in a museum in Vail, Colorado. And this guy, Craig, um, Ray, he was in my house in Sun Valley. So anyway, uh, I called him and talked to him because I was thinking about selling it. Well, they ended up with all of Lawhead's collection. And this, this one right here just sold in Jackson Hole last summer for, what was it, a million and a quarter half? Or no, a hundred and... A hundred and some thousands what it sold for. But when I talked to him, this, this was on the easel. That one right there, Jeff, was probably painted just down the hill from this one right here. But I didn't, I didn't think that that Ray and those guys would sell this painting since it was in the museum. But I don't know what arrangement they did with Cordy, and that was Law Heed's wife. And they came out and stayed a, over a week on our ranch and painted you know, Jacobs and Shear and some other guys that were really, that ended up selling paintings for like 400,000 bucks. I mean, all the guys that he tutored and everything have really done well. And here's the one that sold for Here's the one that sold for over a quarter million bucks was this one right here. And it's called the Bell Ramada. But he did some good paintings. He was a good artist and he was from Quebec. And I'm not sure, Cordy, must, she might have been American or she might have been a uh, this is the Bell Ranch here, and that, that's how it got its name, because it looked like a big bell. But um, there's one in here I really like. This one here is my favorite almost, and I, it, I don't know what it, it sold for or how much. This was done in 1986. But he was one of the he was one of the nicest he was one of the nicest these are all the Canadian scenes here and some of them could have been back east and a lot of them out here in the west there's a mountain standing there well that shadow of your phone Change that.